All right, so it's time for another video, and I don't know how well you guys are going to be able to hear me because they're building three different houses right next to me, as well as behind me. They're grading that entire section of land so they can build another neighborhood. Here comes a fucking bobcat, whatever. Regardless of that, we're going to be doing a brake job today. And by brake job, I mean I got new pads as well as new rotors. So let me just go ahead and show you guys these. I already went ahead and unboxed everything so it wouldn't be so much paper stuff. Here's pads. Um, and these are the front. So they're zinc coated and that zinc will come off whenever I start breaking. But I did get drilled and slotted so those will look a lot better than these crusty ugly ass pieces of shit back there. So those are the front and then the rear. this I think it's weird how different they look but that's what we're gonna be doing today so I'm gonna go ahead and get started on that fillback should be showing up sometime soon so <laughs> got this bitch off I'm really sweaty it's fucking 90 degrees out here and I'm working in the garage where no windows, no airflow, it's just stiflingly hot. I don't know, stifling, stifling, I don't know, it's hot, whatever. I got the rotor off, got the caliper off. I guess now I'm going to do some, first I'm gonna take these things out, these, I don't know what the hell they're called, these bracket pins, whatever. I'm gonna take them out, use some brake cleaner on them, get them all nice and cleaned up so they're not filthy anymore. And then I'm going to put the new pads in, put the new rotor on, bolt it up all together, and uh, hopefully I don't have any issues with the actual caliper itself and the whole piston assembly in there, like pushing those back so it actually fits back on. If I do, I might just have to use like some seat clamps or something to push them back in. So I cleaned those little things. I don't know what they're called. I put them back in there. I got this part of the caliper back on. Here's the new brake pad, and I went ahead and put that in there just so I can see how it is. I'm gonna lube up the back of these, but I'm gonna do it after I get this other one in. So both those going in, lubing them up, and then I'll put the caliper piston back on here, bolt everything up, and it should be good to go. This is me not using my brain, that the piston's only on this side. I'm gonna go ahead and wipe that off just so it doesn't cause any problems later. First one's complete, done, everything's tightened up. I just did the uh, brake pedal up there, just pumped it, make sure everything was getting to it. Wow, that changed really dark once I went like this. Pumped it, make sure it's all there, but it probably won't feel right until I turn the car on and it starts actually pumping with the brake assist and stuff. I'm gonna do the rear next, and since it's the same on each side, I don't think I'll probably show the other side as well. I'll just show once everything's completely done, once all four sides are done, and then we'll go break them in and test them out, make sure I didn't fuck anything up and my brakes actually work. So I was finally able to get this damn rotor off because I don't know, it was just seized on there or whatever. I don't know much about cars, so I'm assuming that that is the whole e-brake assembly in there, all those springs and that bottom cylinder. I don't know, uh, let me know in the comments if that's what that is because I'm thinking that might be what it is, but here's the new rotor, I'm gonna put that bitch on. Rear, completely done. Everything bolted up. Front is now completely done. Everything bolted up. Now, I'm just gonna do the other side. I'm not gonna show any of that just because it's the exact same process. Once I'm done, I'll let you guys know. We'll go out on a test drive. Hopefully they work. Hopefully I didn't fuck anything up. This is my only car. Hi, look who's here. 
Hi vlog. He finally made it. Hi Trevor vlog. We got the other side completely done now. Uh, now it's just up to test driving it and what are the odds they don't work? A lot. <laughs> we should be fine so we'll drive around the neighborhood. I don't know about getting on the bypass just yet but. You have a lot of uh, brake pressure loss when you first start the car but. Yeah. I just sit there and pump them. That's what I was going to do. You want to move your car a little bit so I can get out or? Getting tired of sitting in that bride yet? No. It actually feels pretty normal now. Pretty normal now. Yeah. yeah you got used to it. Yeah. I mean, getting out of it still sucks. <laughs> it's, it's fucking terrible. Sounds like, it sounds like popcorn. It sounds like popcorn. Or like firecrackers. Pop, pop, pop. Yeah. Outside it's like bang, bang. What's that? It comes in the spare tire kit and stuff. Yeah. It is a rotor spreader. So basically like when you take this off, there's two little like holes this size. Yeah. On the rotor and you put this in and twist it and it pushes the rotor off so you can like. Oh, I get it. And beat it with a hammer and stuff. Yeah. So you thread that in so it pushes against the hub. Yep. That's cool. Yeah. I didn't know that. Huh. Yep, don't have one of those in my car. <laughs> Everything's good, no vibrations, no noises. That's why I got that lube, the brake disc lube stuff. Lube? Yeah, I don't know what to call it. But um, here, I'll show you what they look like without the black on them. Oh! Ow, fuck, that's hot. Oh, look at that. Mm. What do you think? I love it. <laughs> I'll put a wheel on. <laughs> yeah, you, you did, did so much. You did yourself. Yep. He showed up the last second, so I did everything. But I don't know what should, what should the next video be. What do we do? I don't know. Maybe comment down below what you think Trevor should do next. Maybe he should do a house tour. Yep. Maybe he should just do a driving by 86 and a full walk around. But anyways, I'll end the video here. Like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>